We'll now show how to install the spring clip strainer in front of the white and strain insulator. Once again, we make a 90 degree handle, which just helps us twist tightly upon itself. So we use an end a white end strain insulator to prevent the shock from touching the post. We use a uh, spring clip strainer tightener to keep tension on the fence itself. We will feed the wire through one of the two holes in the bobbin. Turn it back on itself, flip down the spring. You can then tighten the bobbin to tension the fence. So we just showed how to use the spring clip strainer at the end of our fence line. That works very well for short, if you have to tighten up short distances. The nice thing about our spring clip fence strainer is that we can actually use it as an inline tightener as well. To do that, simply open up the clip, lay the wire inside the strainer. Okay. Once we feed the wire under the notch, take your wrench just start turning that strainer. Set our clip in place. And it just winds the wire tight. 